Hey guys, what's up? And today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make an easy and awesome thumbnail for absolutely free. So first, what you want to do is go to this website, pixlr.com. It's free and you don't even have to download anything at all. You just open the website and do whatever you want. Then you're going to want to um, do Pixlr Editor because that's what we're going to be doing to make the thumbnail. So for our presets, we're going to want to make it um, 1280 by 720. Or you can just change the presets to um, movie and pick at whatever quality you make your movies at. But anyways, and you want to click check transparent and just start just start the um make a new image right here so the first so the first of all first of all look it's pretty much it's really nice you have all the tools on the left right here then you have all of everything that you've done here and um all of your layers that you will create here so it's really nice and you know it's kind of an alternative to photoshop but it's free and you don't have to download anything but anyways, first off, next thing guys, you're going to want to go to Google or any place that you find the best backgrounds and pick out a background. And the important thing to remember is that you want you want the background to be bigger than your existing file in Pixlr because you don't want to stretch it and ruin the quality. So once you've found it, you're going to want to control click or right click depending on what you're using and just save this to your um to your desktop or wherever is your best place to save things. I've already done that. So as you can see here, so you're going to you're going to want to go file open image and then open it. Once you have it opened, you're going to want to control A to um select the whole thing, then control C or command C to um copy it and then command uh command V here onto the uh onto your file here and you can delete this and you don't have to save any um you don't have to save any changes so now that you have it you, there's a bunch of filters that you can do such as um some blurs and you can uh dictate the amount of blurs that you want to do and you know that that's really what I like about this um site it's cuz it's so it has so many options for such an easy and uh free site so, you know, you can, like, sharpen it, whatever, you know. It doesn't really matter. We're just using blue, so you won't see much change. So now, the second thing that you're going to want to do after you've gotten your background is you're going to want to get a picture or something from Google Images. I'm on Yahoo. What am I saying? Let's type minion and make sure to keep it as a PNG. That's very important. Or else it will show the white or black background when you put it in your thumbnail and that's just not what you're gonna want so let's just try minion PNG and what we're looking for is that it has the uh, checkered background and I think I actually like this picture let me see if there's any ones that are actually you know what this is the one that I'm gonna go for uh no it's this one it's definitely this one okay so save image as I'll just save it as a uh, minion simple names don't want to get anything mixed up here so okay there we have save the minion right there now the same we're gonna to want to do the same exact thing open the image get the uh, minion as you can see it's dot PNG which is good that's what we need now we're gonna to want to control a command C to copy the picture and command V paste it in the um, into our thumbnail so now we can delete this picture of the minion. We don't have to save it. And now we can uh, position this minion around to where it looks cool. And I'm just going to put him bottom right corner. And that look that looks pretty cool to me. So uh, after this, what you can do is you can add a, um additional picture or just go straight for the um, straight for the title. All right, guys, so I took the liberty of, you know, adding the other minion that I was looking at and adding a trampoline. I know it looks silly, but, you know, it's just for video purposes. I just wanted to show you that you don't you don't have to just add one picture. It can it can be more than one. So now for the title, which is going to 
you know, you want it to stand out in your videos, and that's kind of one of the most important parts besides the actual pictures. So, first off, what you want to do is you're going to want to add the text and find the area. Whoa. Add some text that I'm going to say awesome. Awesome. Oh. Awesome thumbnail. Now you can change the font to. There's so many. There's tons of fonts. Let me see which one looks pretty cool. Um, so you can choose whatever kind of font that you want, whatever works for you. I'm just trying to see what looks what looks cool. I think I'll use sitcom and add some exclamation marks. Make the size a bit bigger. That looks good. Color. Gonna change the color. Gonna make it, I think, orange. Whoa, what? Here we go. I think that looks pretty cool. Like that. That's a good color. And I wanna make it a bit bigger than that. Just a bit. Center it right here. And it kind of looks like it's pointing. He's pointing to the actual thumbnail title, which it looks good. So anyways, guys, as you can see, you know, it's a silly thumbnail, but this works awesome. And, you know, you can make, you can make thumbnails for all your videos this way. And it's fast, cheap, and you don't have to install anything. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, give me a like. Comment some other videos you'd like to see me do. And I'll see you guys later. Peace.